Round three of the Arena Cup is coming to a close. We have just two more matches, today's match and tomorrow's match, before we actually get to the semifinals. Today is going to be Hunter versus Gatlin. I think it's going to be a really interesting one because yesterday's uh, game and the day before were both like flanker based matches. So this one's going to be very interesting. It's a whole dynamic of the long range and stuff. So let's check out the updated bracket, as you guys can see right here. It's going to be a really interesting one today. I'm super excited. We're going to start with Hunter and then we're going to jump over to Gatlin. So let's jump into some games. Let's have some fun and let's see who moves on to the semifinals. All right, we got Bravewalk Kingdom with Hunter. Now, normally I would be kind of disappointed with Bravewalk, but we do have that long range character now. So it is a little bit different of a story. We are going up against the Judix right here, which we just unfortunately could not hit. But we maybe be able to do some damage to this Yah. Oh, or she'll just stand still. That works too. Uh, we do know the Kelvin is down there as well as the Judix, I believe. Maybe we can deal some damage to this Kelvin. We got him. We got him. Okay, let's back up to our team. I'm also using the new Alien Hunter skin, which is pretty dope. Pretty dope for sure. Oh, we are blinded. Let's just keep jumping. We did see that they're behind us. The Yaw, at least. Okay, we got the Yaw. We got the Yaw. We're doing good so far. We all know Hunter's just really, really strong. So let's see if we can boop the Kelvin back. I think I dealt damage to him. So I'm going to say that that was an assist, but I'm not exactly sure. We are blinded. So let's just keep jumping. Oh, we got her. Okay, hold on, hold on. Let's not get shot. Let's not die. Let's not die. If the Yaw... Oh, Yaw's right here. Oh, no, she's an ult. She's an ult. Let's just jump down. Oh, she jumped down. Oh, that's not good. Can we boop her off map? Oh, we can just kill her outright as the dash. Oh, but the Judix got us. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. We're in this game. This is going to be a game right here. Let's get up here with our Ruby. Oh, we got Kelvin right here. Let's see if we can help the Ruby out. Oh, Yaw's behind us. Let's see if we can get the Kelvin at least. Maybe. I don't know where he went. Let's going to go for the health, actually. That's probably the best bet here. Okay, we have our chemist. I don't know where any of them went, but the ruby is fighting. So, oh, the Kelvin did die. Okay, okay, cool. Well, Kelvin's going to drop. Let's see if we can boop him off the map. Oh, we almost got him. He's going to ult. Oh, we didn't get the kill. That's okay. That's okay. The snowballs are down here. So let's just kind of avoid those. So none of them boop us off the map. Okay, they're gone. I heard the Judix shots, but I don't know where she is. She might be down. Here's Yaw. We're going to at least deal some damage to her. See if we can help out. We got Kelvin right here. Don't let his snowball get me. Yaw's behind. There's so much happening. Oh, we didn't get the Yaw. See if we can maybe steal the Judix kill. Oh, I didn't get the bullets off. See if we can chase. Oh, right into the Kelvin. Awesome. scary scary let's get out let's just get out let's dip let's go for the health i know we kind of left our chemist all alone but you know we kind of have to we have to survive we have to play the survival strats see if we can pop the snowball oh this is probably going to be a death here oh no i had to reload unfortunate unfortunate if i would have had a little bit more bullets i could have got the judix Oh my gosh. Close game. 12 to 12. Ruby's going to wait for us to spawn. All right, let's go, Ruby. I hear them right here. Oh, we got Judix in the center. We got, I think, uh, Kelvin was behind us. Let's see what we can do here. He's going to chase. Oh, no! Kelvin does so much damage with his little snowball slap. It's crazy. I like to call it the slap shot. All right. We're only down by one. Let's see if we can get in there and get some more kills. We do the yaw just chilling right here. She got stuck on the wall. That was an opportunity to get a kill. She's going to go invincible. Oh, Judix is right behind us. Can we get the health? No, Judix got us. I was trying to drop onto the full heal, but that's unfortunate. Unfortunate. Okay, they're up by three now. We can maybe get the yaw right here. Let's see, is anyone over there? 
No one's close enough for me to scan, so at least they're not right here. Okay, we got Kelvin over there. He's just going to sit and wait. See if we can do something to this yaw. This Didn't mean to use my ult there, but it'll work. Oh, the snowballs. Okay, we need to make a comeback right here. We can get the Judix. We can get the Kelvin. Survive, team. Survive. Let's go. Come back with the win by one. Got the double kill at the end. I don't know if it's going to be enough for a super high score, but we're going to go for it. Let's jump into the next game and let's see how Gatlin does. All right, we got Crossroads. Absolute favorite map. They do have an enemy Gatlin though, so... And they have a Jabali that they're going to be able to sit behind. So we're going to have to play some unique angles here. Let's just go ahead and reload while the Jabali's chilling. He's just big chilling. You got to push out and he's dead. Okay, so he was really weak. That's why he was chilling there. Let's see if we can do the uh, the Gatlin battle. We're going to be able to hold the like the mid range or the, the middle of the map, the mid lane. Uh, pretty comfortably, I would say. Just because, you know, you can do so much damage from so far away. We just want to make sure that the Gatlin can't see us. So we're literally going to be playing the long range. And trying to deal damage to everyone up this middle lane. That's probably going to be the best bet. And we can also stick to, like, the side lanes, like this angle right here that I have with the shell. We also have the Jabali on us, so if we let him get too close... Don't shoot him, don't shoot him. Oh, no! I didn't know the Gatlin pushed up that far. It's so one thing with his second ult, with Jabali's second ult, you gotta just super watch when he pops it. Because if you are if you have auto fire on, and you're dealing damage, and he pops that second ult, you're just gonna start laying into that shield, and it's just gonna electrocute you, so... It's a really, really strong deterrence, I would say. At least we know he has that second ult on, though. So we can kind of play around that now. We know he's not going to kind of push up too close. We're going to get a better angle here. We're going to go ahead and pop a reload as well. He is behind. I'm going to pop my shield just to be a little safe with the close range because we know Jabali's over here. Did he wrap back this way? Let's push up over here. Okay, no one no one wrapped this way. I thought I thought I heard someone on that side. It was probably just the Jabali. We do see the Gatlin in the spawn. Let me see if I can take some far range damage. I'm gonna try to weaken that shield as much as possible. We do have our Gloria on our left to hopefully deter the shell flank. And we are gonna get that. Shell's gonna push up right here. We're just gonna go pop out in close range. Shell is so scary close range. I'm telling you guys, you need to be playing Shell right now because she's going to get the flank on our Gloria. She's going to be doing so much damage. Oh, she didn't Gloria flank. Okay. I'm telling you guys, Shell is nuts right now. Okay, hold on, hold on. We're just going to back up. We're going to back up. Hunter just spawned. Gatlin just spawned. We're going to kind of get a little peek up the mid. Oh, there's Shell. Shell's going to probably push this way. Oh, but we have the Jabali with his shield. You got to watch that shield. We're going to have to take this range, the close range fight to the Jabali. I have 130 bullets, so we're just going to have to wait till he drops his shield. We did get him. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Where's the... Oh, the Gatlin's dead. I was like, where'd the Gatlin go? I don't know where the shell is. Everyone's spawned in now, so we kind of have to just watch everything. You guys got to pay attention to who's spawning. The timers of spawning. We're going to pop this to help our team. Let's see if we can get the Jabali. We can. We got the shell right here. She's going to throw her reality hack. Oh, and she did transport to it. So she's going to get that easy flank double. Man, dude. Shell is crazy. Both of her ults are super, super good. And I am actually going to be doing a tier list video. And I will be mentioning, you know, different ults and different choices and, um, you know, game types and whatnot as well as talking about each hero. So stay tuned for that. I think the Jabali's pushing this way. I did see him on that side of the map. And if he does, we'll have a, a little advantage on him here. Let's play up the middle here. We got the shell. Oh, no, Jabali's this way. We're going to have to just back up here. We're going to keep our distance. Shell is going to push too. Let's get a reload before anyone can kind of like see us. 
if she if she transports we have her oh she's out she's out okay we got the shell we got the shell put some pressure up the middle so they don't push we're gonna go uh get the heal get the heal i'll i'll, I'll be fine just try to deal as much damage to his turret or hit to his turret to his shield as we can okay we got the kill too that's what's up okay again i don't know where the gatlin oh there she is she jumped out she ulted we're gonna ult as well we're gonna have to try to kill this shell right here come on no shell shell came in clutching at the last kill that would have pushed us over into winning that one unfortunate i just missed a couple of my hip fire sprays but hey gallon still put up a good show let's go check out the results and let's see who moves on to the semi-finals all right the results are in so hunter had nine kills four deaths and four assists putting his total to 16 points and gatlin had eight kills four deaths and one assist putting her total to 12.5 hunter moves on to the semi-finals gatlin is out it's unfortunate because I, I was having some pretty high hopes with Gatlin. She was my most played hero last season and I tried my best, but you know, we just, we have good enemies. We have pretty good teammates too, but we had good enemies uh, against the Gatlin and it was just, it was really tough, especially with that little last second shell kill that could have potentially made the difference. But unfortunately Gatlin's out, Hunter moves on. You guys can see right here on the updated bracket. This is a really interesting one. They were both really long range heroes. We kind of know that Hunter is probably one of the most, if not the most broken character in the game right now. And like I said, I will be doing a tier list pretty soon on all of the heroes in the game. So stay tuned for that. But Gatlin, Gatlin's out. Hunter moves on. Leave a like on the video, guys. Subscribe for some more T3. Tomorrow is going to be the last match in round three. This will determine the four heroes that are going to be in the semifinals that are going to be playing for that, fin that like finale spot, that final spot to see who is the winner of the entire Arena Cup. Tomorrow is going to be Skatey versus Zero Kelvin, so it's going to be really interesting. One of the first heroes that I actually ended up like mastering and maining. I love Skatey to death. And then we have Zero Kelvin, the new hero that I've been playing a ton of, and I actually really, really like his play style. So that's going to be a really interesting one. Stay tuned for that tomorrow. But I'll catch you guys next time. Thanks for watching. And as always, peace out, guys.